Hey there, I'm Michael Sean McDonald from MichaelSeanMcDonald.com, coming to my home office here in Winnipeg, Manitoba. Now today, we're doing a little recording on how to upload your documents to Dropbox. Dropbox is a, is a, a free, um, for the most part free, where you can, uh, so you made an ebook or you want to share documents with your team, um, or an ebook where you want to start gener learning how that you can use to generate leads online. So it's a very simple thing. You just create your own account then you'll come in here so as you see my own accounts right here You've already logged in you get so much space right so you get two gigs of space um, I've used only seven ten anyway so I still have a lot of room to go but if you want to upgrade your account you can um, it simply click on upgrade account and it comes in here and it will tell you what everything is for so 1075 14 17 and then there's an enterprise which you just ask them for for pricing right so depending on what your needs are maybe pro is fine you know going up to you can even try this one for free okay I have no affiliates to them but anyways it's a good little thing that I love to use okay so what you would do here say you got a brand new account right so you go to files okay simply click on files on the left hand side up top, you got some folders here. You got some delete, some uh, where you can show your deleted folders to clear them out, uh, share a folder, create a new folder, then share it, right? Or just simply upload a document. What you want to do is click on upload. Okay, choose a file, read all this stuff, choose a file. Come in here, I'm going to use this file, I've already set it up, okay? So I'm going to choose day one email. Okay, so move myself up there. Open and it uploads it. You can add more files if you wanted to. If you're done, then simply click done. All right, move myself back down. So now here is the template, the 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 upload right here. Okay. So now what do you do if you want to share the link, right? So and you have to get the links, right? So here you go. You click in the links. And it will have a lost this. So you go into settings. So files. Let's do a refresh. We have it right here. Maybe because it's a text. Maybe that's what it is. But anyways, your settings would be right here. Where you have a Anyone can link to this file. You go in here, go to your settings. Um, you can anyone can link only passwords. So if you have a, a say you're giving away and it's something that people have to pay for, um, they pay for it, then you can send them an email with the password so that they can get in. All right. So we click on cancel. You can also copy the link here, which it shows you exactly where the link is, and you copy that so that you can go to your autoresponder. Okay, so that's exactly how you will upload documents to um, Dropbox and how you can attach those links. Now the next thing you want to do is I'm going to keep on going here since uh, we're use, learning how to, how to generate leads and how you can attract them to you with your PDF giveaway. So the next thing you do is you go to Aweber, okay? So you go into Aweber here, and it will use this one here. This is where my ebook is sent out to my prospects right away. Okay. So you come in here, and here it is. So cool. First of all, welcome to my newsletter. First of all, I'm going to receive daily tips, tricks, growing. So I'm explaining to them right here. They're getting stuff daily from me. That's going to help grow their business. Okay. My goal to you. So here's my purpose. My goal to you is to truly help you. I hate hype and fluff. Excellent. If you need some real stuff, you're in the right place, okay? You won't be slam junk offers like self proclaimed guru's pitch, right? So snag your ebook here. Now, here's one thing I'm changing on this right now is I want this to stand out. So we're going to make this go to 22. The rest of it is all, and we're going to fix that. The rest of it is all in 18, okay? Now, that's not important, but now what you want to do. Is you want to create your hyperlink right so I bold it underline make it italic underline it so they know there's a hyperlink there then you want to go into where it shows says link 
You'll come in here. Here's your link. You paste what you just copied from Dropbox from the settings, right? From the settings, you copy that and you paste it in here. Then you simply click OK. Since I didn't change anything, I don't want to change anything, I'm going to just click on X. But if you're setting everything up, then that's what you want to do. Okay, did we do one in here? Yes, we did. So there's a hyperlink there as well. We also have it like this. So let's make it bold so it stands out. We want to also change it. We'll make this 20. There we go, here. Right? A little bit more. And we're going to make it, we're going to highlight. So I'm showing you exactly what I do all the time here. There we go. It stands out, correct? And we're going to save it. All right. So now, what next thing you do is I'm a, if a father of three, such as me, active kids can do it, so can you. So we're just going in, watch this video, something else. We're going to make that bigger as well. Um, simple, 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 simple. AWeber is one of the easiest things to do. One of the little tricks is making sure you put some dots down here so that it pushes down your unsubscribes so you don't have a lot of unsubscribes. All right. So there you go. Perfect. So now you know how to actually upload a document to Dropbox. And you also know how to get the link from Dropbox so that you can paste it into your AWeber email. Now, did you get value out of this? If you did, great. Simply go to michaelshawmcdonald.com forward slash mastery and you can see a video that my buddy Brian did, he created uh, just for you so that you can see how some tools could help you grow your business and also once you're in there, leave your, your phone number and if it's in North America here, I'll definitely give you a call. If it's not, um, just simply, I'll contact you through Facebook and we'll have a, a call through Facebook. All right, so simply just leave your name and number um, and we'll get back to you with your email and uh, talk to you later and if you want to get the the email that you got right here just go to microsoftdonald.com forward slash 10 objections all right have yourself a great day thank you very much and make sure you like share and leave a comment below what value you got what did you really like about this video thank you very much talk to you later